never really know how I'm going to be jumping, but my best guess today is pretty good because yesterday was pretty good. So it's the day after yesterday, so I don't know. Anyway, it's really hard to pick which rim and I try to go on based on how I'm jumping. So I still don't know which rim I'm going to choose today, but whatever. Let's go. I kind of drooled. So I decided on 10-2. Let's get it. This gym is actually one of the nicest LA fitnesses and it's very empty like very often. Often. But uh, because no one ever comes here, but this rim's 10-2. The other one's like 9-9, 9-10. So if only this was like 10 feet legit, I'd have like a heaven court right by my house. But I'll stick with 10-2. Maybe I'll just become a beast on 10-2, you know? It's always shocking on the way down because it's a significantly higher drop. <laughs> so I have two knees and recently my right one's been acting up strange, not painful, just strange. That one's feeling good. My other one, my left one, which I jump up off one foot, always has given me pain. But of the recent past, I've gotten that healthy and it feels good. But I did a lot of one foot yesterday, not a lot, but more than usual. And it feels a little bit painful, but it's still better than usual. So we'll see. I might not push it today, but we'll see. I want to keep getting it better. It's close to 100%. It's so hard to get it to 100%. I don't know if I'm going to be able to. Okay, I'm done. Oh, I think I got My forearm feels for punching. Oh, check this out, by the way. Can you see how bruised that is? It's a crazy bruised. Anyway, my form feels really good on that. I think once I'm warm, I'll be able to get it. Let's go! I have a good amount of energy, but I think I'm slightly hesitant off my left knee. So I took a little pre-workout just to get me to that level. You feel me? I'm not jumping my highest. I don't know if it's uh, hesitation or just fatigue from yesterday, but I'm going to try to get full jumps. Probably my best jump today. I was scared to land on it. Uh, not bad. My technique is pretty off on all my dunks just because I've been like rehabbing my knee and haven't been dunking as much. But besides that, jumping well. Uh, my form felt good off the dribble on 10-2, but I wasn't jumping my highest. And I think it was a little bit of fatigue and hesitation, not just one or the other. But uh, my form felt good. I didn't have any pains in my knee, knees, pain in my knees. But um, 
I got really close to some. I should be able to get it soon, but uh, I'm, I'm happy with my dribble dunk technique. And uh, I just probably from here on out, I'm gonna, not from here on out, but like the next couple of sessions, probably gonna be like light and recovery because I jumped a lot this weekend, especially today. And then after that, maybe get back to the regular routine of full health training. And uh, besides that, jumping well. And I think if I do some light explosive recovery days, I can have a solid technique day. And then I think I should be flying and have a lot of good dunks. I'm loving my reverse too. I gotta get that down. And that's pretty much it. Let's get it.